Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to The Dig for more point and click adventure game action. We are back where we left off. Uh, things took a very dramatic turn last time, didn't they? We reactivated an alien corpse who seemed to be friendly, but we couldn't understand a word he was saying. Or she. We don't, we don't know whether he even has genders. Um, and then Maggie was attacked by something else, some sort of weird beast looking thing. So we're heading across to the museum now to see if she's okay. And also whether we're going to have to fight something off. So we've got to head through, sorry, through the museum to the library. We're going to the library, aren't we? So God knows what we're going to find in this place. But it looked like she got that computer up and running, which might turn out to be, oh no, it's gone off again. She's gone. Not a trace. Oh, she's not here. Not a sign of struggle. Nothing. Huh. So could it have been lured in by this, being powered up? Is that what what attracted it? Console. Is there anything over here? No. Can we use this or can Maggie only use it? A control console. Uh phew. Do we have anything that could power it up? Maybe. This is a library. Then this must be where you search and retrieve data. It won't accomplish anything. Okay. Um, let's try both scepters. It won't accomplish anything. I don't suppose we can use a crystal on it. It's not doing anything. That's. A control console. If this is a library, then this must be where you search and retrieve data. Yeah. The question is, how did she activate this? So, is there anything... I mean, there's the other consoles, but they're broken, aren't they, I think, if I remember correctly. I don't think we'll be able to fix this screen. Yeah, so when we saw Maggie before she got attacked, this thing had writing all over it. So, I don't know if there is a way to power it up, or maybe she knows how to power it up. If this is a library, then this must be where you search and retrieve data. <sighs> I mean, I don't think we've got anything here that is going to help us out with this. A control console. If this is a library, then this must be where you search and retrieve data. Right, so that's a bit of a dead end, I guess, for now. So, my next idea was he called Brink and asked Brink to come and help, didn't he? Uh, but Brink didn't answer. So, could that mean Brink was involved with whatever happened here? Possibly. Um, which one was Brink at? Was he at the tomb? We last saw him up on that, that cliff part, didn't we? Where he was playing around with that relic. So, perhaps we head there and see if he's still there. Oh, there he is. I can see him. Okay, he is still here. Uh, also, I want to try something here because Silo Cat was saying something about um, what what don't bats like or something like that. So I was thinking we've got several things. Bats don't like light. Is that correct? And we do actually have a torch. So I was wondering if we could shine the torch up at these things because that would get rid of the problem of it being out of reach and also it would provide light so I want to try that while we're here come on guys let's get a look at you nice yes it did work Go away. oh He's scared of them. I wasn't expecting that to happen. I mean, we kind of needed to speak to him, so... <laughs> that's not ideal, actually. Why didn't he answer the call, then? Anyway, what do we have here? This is what he was looking at, right? So, can we get a closer look at this now? What kind of contraption has Brink made here? Oh, did Brink make this? Oh look, you can see that thing we made last time. What kind of contraption has Brink made here? 
when we um, completed the moon map. You can see the moons over there now. That's quite cool. That's a nice little touch. What is this then? Can we... It won't accomplish anything. Uh, right, okay. Can we call Brink and see where he went? <laughs> Brink, come in, Brink. No. Great. I don't know where he to play hide and seek. ran off to. Well, I don't have time to waste on children's games. Uh, I don't suppose we can call Maggie. Maggie, come in. Come in, Maggie. Where are you? I hope I can find her in time. God, okay. We can't call Borden or Miles, can we? Load a shuttle. Come in, Ken. Way out of range. Load a shuttle. Come in, Cora. Way out of range. Okay, so uh, that's kind of annoying that we scared Brink off there because I wanted to talk to him. <laughs> so, where oh, can we go up there? Looks like a bit of a staircase or something. No. Okay. Oh, what was that? Hang on. Crystal stash. Get away from there. Ah, he's back. Right, so that's where he put all these crystals. Don't meddle with my work. The only work you're doing is feeding an addiction. An addiction? I'm addicted to learning, to knowledge, to great mental achievements. Right. Get a grip on yourself, Brink. What are you doing here, Low? I don't want you here. Yeah, well, we need your help. Something happened to Maggie. She needs our help. Then go help her. I need your help. What I'm doing here is important. Hey, if we felt that way about you, you'd still be dead. Yeah, that's right. You're the tough guy, Lo. You're the hero. Go do your hero activities and let me do the science. Wow, I really thought he would have more to say about that. I don't suppose we can talk to him about anything else. What is he building over here? It has got bigger actually, hasn't it? Brink. Right, let's talk about the Maggie's monster. In trouble. Then go help her. Maggie's in trouble. I'm sorry to hear of this. I will miss Maggie a great deal. What do you mean you'll miss her? So he obviously knows something. Brank, there's a dead alien sealed inside a crystal tomb. In a culture that can raise the dead, they probably have a good reason when they choose to bury somebody instead of reviving him. Now leave me alone. That is sort of a fair point. The map shows a passage under that tomb I found. There must be something important down there. Yeah, there is. Maggie was on the brink of telling me what the inscriptions in the library meant. Do you understand what that means? Yes, you'll be able to borrow alien science fiction novels from the library and entertain <laughs> yourself. You really don't care about anything but yourself, do you? I care about something much more important than all our paltry selves. All right. I'm worried that these life crystals may have side effects. The only side effect is the envy of people who haven't used them. Have you used more of them? Their effect on health and intelligence increases with each use. What about their effect on sanity? These life crystals are the most important technology ever created. They are the answer to everything. I don't think that's true. <laughs> I think you might be deluding yourself a bit there. Right, uh, this tablet. With all your newfound brilliance, Brink, can you make any sense out of this? I don't have time to analyze every meaningless bit of debris you pick up and carry around with you, Commander Low. I mean, all you're doing is building some weird little contraption, so I'm sure you could. These light bridges link the spires. It's a lot faster than using the trams. I'm so happy for you. I found a bunch of these metal plates. When we've got them all, maybe we can go home. You remember home, don't you, Brink? Earth, family, friends, food. You're doing very well, Commander Lowe. By all means, go find the rest of the metal plates. Go quickly. Go now. <laughs> why? Why is he so dismissive of us being I don't around know what this? You're doing right now, Brink, 
but those ghosts said things they wanted us to do, and we need to get home. And you're not doing either one. What I'm doing is more important. But I'll never accomplish anything while I have incessant interruptions. All right, well. Get your priorities straight. We're talking about Maggie's life here. What do you know about life? And if she's killed, so what? We just bring her back better than ever. You know, maybe she doesn't want that. What should we do about Maggie? You go look for her, I stay here and work. Alright, well, a lot of help you've been. So, thank you, not. Can we what nick these? I'm gonna steal your crystals. I don't need your help. Hmm. Okay, so... I feel like maybe we've got to take these somehow. I don't know how, but the fact that we can get Brink out of this area by using the torch, to me, means that we can do something here. Come on, guys. Let's get a look at you. When he's not around. The question is, what? Go away! So he runs off. We can come back here. If we try and take that, he comes back. So the only other thing I can think of is we have to do something with this. What kind of contraption has Brink made here? I don't know what we have to use. Um... I don't want to damage the mechanism. Right, he doesn't want to damage it. Does this show anything? There's a signal here, but I'm not getting a clear reading. Okay. It doesn't point in any direction. Uh I don't suppose we can use this in it. I can't use these two things together. No. Okay. Can we break it or something? The shovel is useless here. Oh, the shovel's useless. How can that be right? It won't accomplish anything. No. Uh, I don't suppose we can... It won't accomplish anything. Hmm. I feel like we've got to do something with this, but... It won't accomplish anything. I honestly don't know what. We tried the scepters on it, didn't we? It won't do anything. Yeah. Alright, so we've tried pretty much everything we have. These two things together. We've got to do something to this, obviously, but as soon as we try and take this, he comes Get back. Away from there. Don't meddle with my work. The only work you're doing is feeding an addiction. An addiction? I'm addicted to learning, to knowledge, to great mental achievements. Get a grip on yourself, Brink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, that didn't work either, so... Hmm. I mean, pff, I don't really know what to try now. I feel like we've got to do something here. I mean, I don't know where... Maggie went to. Can we go this way? I don't know. We're just going to have to it's sort of lens I uncovered. sort of look around, I guess. I don't, I don't really want to get on the tram again. So where the hell could Maggie have gone? That's the question. I honestly don't know. Uh, we've got the map, we've got the museum area. The planetarium. We still haven't got to this one yet. Let's go to the planetarium and see if there's anything around there. I don't think there will be. 
There was nothing in there, was well, let's have a look. I don't suppose the cave's anything. No, it doesn't look like it. What I don't get is where did that monster come from? <clears throat> because we've never seen anything like it the whole time we've been here. But it seems like potentially powering up that display in the library maybe activated it or made it come and investigate. I don't know. I don't want to go in the cave. So nothing here. Perhaps you go this way? I can't even remember what was through this way, to be honest. We've got this waterfall here. Crevice. What was through this way? Oh, uh, yes, this area. What was that? A crevice, okay. Yeah, right. Like I'm gonna stick my hand in some crack in the rock on an alien planet. We couldn't go down here, could we? What's that? Nothing. We haven't done anything here, actually, which is interesting. It won't accomplish anything. Can we stick anything in there? It won't accomplish anything. Can we, like, put one of the rods in? It won't do anything. Huh. Okay, well... That seems like we haven't really done an awful lot here, to be honest. So, can we go anywhere else? We've been there, we've been there. Should we go to the map spire now and see if there's anything there we can find? Let's head back in here. I don't know where this door is that I've missed. I was told that I missed a door somewhere, but I'm not really sure... Unless it's like behind there or something. Yeah, I can't see anywhere else in here. What is it? What are like all these? They look a bit like eggs or something, but I don't think they are. I think it's just like mushrooms or some sort of fungi or something. Uh, right, there's the pit. What was in the pit again? Oh yeah, this place with all the, the bat things again. Uh, I can't actually interact with the pit though. To like scare the bat things off with the torch. Uh, there's the chamber. Just gonna have to do a bit of looking around, I think. We've got the chamber, we've got the pit, the ledge. Alright. The ledge it is. Oh wait, was there a way that way? I just want to check down here. Oh! <gasps> there is! This must be where I missed the door. Okay, nest. What's this? Oh god, it's Maggie! Okay. Maggie! Is that you? Are you alright? How could you be all right, bound up in that web like that? So it's like some sort of spider thing. There it is. There, look. This guy is big and nasty. How did? It... How did it bring her all the way here? Right. So there's the monster. There's Robins. There's a grate there. Huh? What's this grate? It looks like a grate sealing something off. Okay. Uh, this doesn't really seem like the time to talk about things, to be honest. Uh, can we ask about Maggie about the library? This is 
really bad timing, Boston. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. Uh, okay. Thanks. Is there anything we can use here? The web is too strong for that to work. Right. Uh, can we cut it? The web is too strong for that to work. All right. Can we like cut it with this thing? Because it's jagged. The web is too strong for that to work. Okay. So, nothing down there. So the web is too strong. I don't suppose it's scared of light. I don't want to be the one to attract his attention. Okay. Can we use it on the grate? It won't accomplish anything. Uh mm. I don't suppose we can open this. It won't accomplish anything. Hmm. Okay, well, we need to do something with this grate. The question is what? And we need a f to find... Austin, where are you going? I'm over here. Bring help. I'm trying, I'm trying. Right, okay, so... Man, that is um, an interesting situation that we're going to have to solve pretty quickly by the looks of things. But uh, we'll leave it there for today because we're out of time. So as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.